just breathing in that fresh air of the redwood forest. And I found some mushrooms. Come. Coriolis, also known as tricky tail mushroom. This is a beautiful batch right here. You can tell because a, you're getting a lot of those beautiful colors and strands like the reds. You're getting a little tiny pinch of the blue. These are a little bit in their elder season. They have the white tip on the edge, not the dark. That's how you know they're in prime condition. Now to know it's turkey tail, you want to feel that velvet, baby. You want to touch and it should feel nice and soft and smooth. And when you pick it, you should see here that there's no gills. It's actually like thousands and thousands of mini tiny little spores, little tiny dots. It smells extremely mushroomy and here's the cool thing about turkey tail. You can actually take a little bit, like this. And it's like chewing gum in the woods. Freshens their breath. Tastes a little bit mushroomy, but gives you a little bit burst of an energy. Turkey tail mushroom has something called polysaccharide K. All the medicinals have polysaccharides, but this specific one, polysaccharide K, the number one best-selling cancer-fighting drug in Japan. Japan's a big place. There's a lot of cancer-fighting drugs. The best one and the most sold one is from turkey tail mushroom extraction. So you can fight cancers with it. It's amazing for your immune system. It stimulates and nourishes it. And then lastly, I like to associate it to almost the chakra system. I'm gonna go there. See all these different colors? It's kind of like a different chakras from red all the way up to purples and whites. You're getting all types of layers. I feel it's like a very all-rounded, well-rounded mushroom that can be used in brews and extractions and overall, just a beautiful one. You can find it pretty abundantly on deadwood trees. And that's the way to roll when you find turkey tail mushroom. Chew a piece of gum, hunt through the woods.